Hi everybody, Chris Helms here from the Ather Planetarium. I'm the Collections Manager. Today I want to show you a really cool portable diptych sundial that was made in 1513 by a man named Erhard Etzlaub, a German cartographer who primarily printed maps for pilgrims showing the routes to Rome. The really special part of this sundial is that it includes a map showing Europe and the north of Africa, which could be used to help a traveler set the instrument for the latitude of their current location. While this amazing sundial is missing a few parts that make it work properly, we have another example of a sundial from roughly about the same time so that we can demonstrate how it all works. In order to tell the time, the sundial must be placed on a flat surface, and then the compass is used to align the sundial with a north-south line called the local meridian. The gnomon, which is the name of the piece that casts a shadow showing the time on the hour scale, is typically a string that must be stretched between the two halves, with the upper end placed on, on the correct latitude. The sundial would then be ready for use, provided of course that the sun was actually out and shining on it. This is what the shadow of the gnomon would look like on the hour scale. Check out the comments below to see where you can view this object and objects like it, either in the Adler or online, and be sure to follow us for more behind the scenes content.